Hey guys, Zethrion here from Languister C and we're gonna dive straight into SS for the week of 9th to 15th December. I just read the update note and unfortunately we will not be getting triple S difficulty uh, this week. Uh, a bit a bit of a shame. I was hoping not to need to do A plus anymore, but oh well. Okay, so this is the annoying time law that we faced in S5. I'll just get into it, see what we are faced. Wow. <laughs> okay, that's a lot of... Um, that's a lot of lancers, huh? Okay. So I can take this one out on the first turn, I think. Uh, uh, once I have Ultimate Muller. So am I just not going to tank it? Yeah, are we just going to do tankless? Ultimate Muller for his buff. Bozo and Lana for magic damage. Yeah, it looks like we're going to go tankless, huh? Okay, I'm going to bring... Um, I'm going to bring uh, Liana just for the flexibility of again. And we're just going to go ham with the magic damage. Let's see whether I can one shot the Lava Titan with Lana. Hopefully. If not, there's always Ultimula. So, um... First course of action is to faction buff up. We're just gonna rely on pure stats to kill it. Although the stats aren't that impressive actually. <laughs> oh well. Alright, one shot, one kill. That would be because of the. And that opens up a space for Leon to go to move. To kill uh, this Dark Arrow Sniper. Oh wow. Oh right, because it's physical that oh come on man, that's annoying. Luckily Liana has boots, so you will not be able to replicate this unless your Liana is wearing boots. Uh, which is why I find boots actually very helpful for maps like these. And we are gonna ultimate in and faction buff up. I'm hoping that the Lava Titan decides to guard instead of attacking us. Let's see. Yep, there we go. Everyone's gonna guard up. Mass attack, mass attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they have no healers, which is nice. Which means that we can just attrition them away. We are going to back hole. Actually, why, why not just Blizzard everybody? Because Blizzard will reduce their mobility and prevent them from attacking Lana. As such. Uh, I'm not gonna bother attacking with Leon, not when the Time Law is in effect. Uh, okay. And everybody move up please. There we go. Move up, move up, move up. Very nice. Okay. So, um, Ice uh, Free Strike has uh, cooled down, so we're able to kill off that, uh, that Lava Titan. Good, very nice. And do I have it? No, I don't have it, unfortunately. It being, um, uh, chivalry and again. Oh wow, that was almost successful. We're gonna kill off the mage. So at most we're gonna lose Ultimola, I think. I don't think they should be able to kill two of our units at, uh, at a go. I'm just gonna get out of the way. Just so I don't tempt the mage from attacking. The mage should attack Ultimola, who is a natural target. And the Lancer General should... Yep, there we go. As expected, it dies. And Lancer General should uh, attack, or try to attack um, Leon instead. That's fine. We are going to kill off the mage, hopefully. 
without killing off ourselves. Oh, come on, man. Seriously? That was ridiculous. Uh, I am going to again Lana. And free strike this bugger, even though without the faction buff, I'm not going to be able to one shot it. But it should do enough damage that it will not be able to kill Leon, and Leon can just finish it off. Okay, so a brute force, no tank approach to SS1. It's, I think that's about as fast as you can clear it. Uh, SS2, battling against cavalry and flyers, all stats increased by 50%. So you don't want to bring cavalry and flyers. Oh my god. It's one of those, isn't it? <laughs> one of those meaning and annoying uh, everyone is split map okay so cavalry and flyers cavalry and flyers well it could be worse it could be Let's see now, if I have Hind here, he moves down here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, which is here. And if I move Ledin forward, he'll be in range of Divine Guard. Of course, uh, but if I move Ledin forward, Liana will not be in range of Divine Guard, which will be an issue. Unless Liana is here. And then Ledin comes forward and she moves here. That would be Divine God range. And the Tiaris is here. And then that will make it such that she can catch up with Ledin. Okay, I think we have a plan. I just need to equip Hind. Oh! Never mind, he is equipped. How interesting. Uh, I must have forgotten that I equipped him earlier. Leon, is this the best place for Leon to be? I guess. Of course, if my teleport miscal uh, calculations are off, then we're kind of stuck. But we'll see what happens. Uh... Okay, good. My calculations are on point. Weak, weak, weak. Everyone is weak. Everyone. Uh... Hates Leon because of the stat increase. Oh wow. Anyway, I'm not attacking to kill it. Oh my god, he suicides. Okay, I guess that's not that's not uh that's not uh, good then. Let's see whether we can kill the archer. Without dying in the process, that would be nice. Death breath. We are going to uh, Divine Guard. Hold on, let me come forward and. Uh, no, I have to wait until after that. So she has to be here to again him. And Leon's not going to be in cover, but I'm hoping that. Um, the melee enemies will see the juicy mages and hit them instead. Although they might just go for Dion because she's weak to them, unfortunately. Yeah, okay, so that flame skeleton goes for Dion. Oh dear, he's gonna pull Hind hopefully. Pull Hind, yes, very good, thank you. A predictable AI. Okay, good, so letting guards for Hind. Okay, the gargoyle is almost, but not quite. Oh, never mind. Forget I said that. He is dead because of the Reaper's breath. Very nice. We're gonna guard for Liana. With Ledin. Okay, good. Takes massive damage. Doesn't die, but we didn't I never expected it to die. Skeleton Master comes forward and dies to Ledin. Great. Hopefully the Skeleton Knight will die to Ledin as well. Then we're just left with. Uh, then we're just left with not a lot of enemies actually. Okay, we are going to hit this flame skeleton. 
Oh wow, it dies. Fantastic. Um, uh, she's blocked. That's not good. We're gonna heal up high. Remove that debuff from him and pray that he can one shot this aquatic general, which he can. Excellent. So far, so good. We are gonna park Leon. Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Ah, uh, let's just do it. Okay, do it. Ah, uh, no, I'm, I'm a coward. I'm just gonna. That girl's gonna stay put. So, the only reason I brought Leon is because he. Um, can very nice because he can do that attack and move again thing which helps our team uh, join up again otherwise obviously this map is heavily stacked against him where he suicides when attacking a melee enemy let's all swell that ends well that was quite a fun map to puzzle through I don't think I utilized the full uh, uh, movement uh, of Liana, taking ranged attacks, okay, so whatever, so that's going to be easy. Any tentacles? No tentacles, so we just need to tank it up and Ultimula and whatever it up. I love this map with Ultimula because of how much we can abuse the terrain in striking in and out like that. But anyway, let's just get into it. Okay, let him move up. Action buffs. No surprise there. Maybe I should have started here instead. Ah, uh, never mind. Okay, we are going to faction buff. I wonder if he can reach the Leviathan. And that would eliminate one annoying enemy. One, two, three. Who else can hit there? Nobody, actually. Yeah, why not? You have A, oh, you have aim, so she can move 1, 2 and hit here. But Leon will be 1, 2, 3 here. Okay, so we actually can get that done. Yeah, why not? I hate Leviathans, especially when uh, they are all like buffed up with Tidal Surge. So maybe this is not the most logical move to make. But I'm gonna make it anyway. Full charge distance, 5 charge, attack pressing. An assault should result in one dead Leviathan and one hopefully safe Leon. Let's see. Aim shouldn't be close enough. Good, it isn't. Strike shouldn't be close enough either. Okay, good, 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 excellent. Everyone's where we want them. We're gonna hit the Elf General with Leon. And this is what I mean by using and abusing terrain to our benefit. Okay, I'm gonna beat. Uh, wait, are you within me? No, you're not within me. Okay. And we're gonna miracle up. So that Leon next turn can either take out either the Flame Archer or the Assassin. So this map is so strange. This uh, SS map is even easier than the S maps that we were facing earlier. Anyway, what 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 even is the time law? I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's kill this thing. I'm not sure if it will die with miracle. Oh, it does. Fantastic. So um. We're gonna advance aggressively. Do I have Divine Guard this turn? I do. Let's just kill it off. Very good. Uh, I'm gonna stay out of range of this thing though. So let's move here. Which should be within range of. Oh, it's just a Hellhound though. Oh well. Oh well. Sad. The world is me. Okay, attack blessing next turn. Flame Archer can't do anything. We killed the Hellhound. Good. Lobster moves towards uh, Leon, which is like, okay, if you insist. But we are going to evade Lobster. 
and killed his friend the flame archer instead. I'm not sure if they're friends, I'm just making that up. Okay, there we go. Okay, so everyone's safe. Which is just hilarious, honestly. We are gonna attack Blessing on Ultimola. And we do have a Gin, so we can move twice. Which should be enough attacks to kill off uh, the Lobster Behemoth. Yep, first attack. Not enough. Gil? Nah, you're gonna make me again, you aren't you? Okay, Ultimuna is gonna smash that lobster. And that will be the end of SS3. Okay, straightforward and simple for SS3. Cannot be dispelled. Okay, uh, I'm probably going to just uh, pause the video or just take a break here because it's almost midnight on Monday and I'll probably finish this up and upload it as one whole video tomorrow, Tuesday. Okay guys, back again for SS4. Unfortunately, there was a break of two days. I did SS1 to 3 on Monday and yesterday was just really busy with the new banner. So, uh, we are about to head into SS4 for the final uh, few stages. Four ranged enemies after attacking damage is reduced by 20%. So we need to make the most of our attacks. Either that or we can we bring a tank that can retaliate at range. But I'm thinking if I do this, many many people will be upset. <laughs> Because not everybody has Landius up yet. So I'm just going to stick with my uh, usual uh, team. And uh, we'll try to kill off uh, these enemies with Ledin's counter attacks. And then we'll slowly whittle down the ranged enemies. Hopefully we'll one shot them uh, with Leon and Ultimula. So that we can uh, not draw this out too long. Okay, too much talking. So little action, let's get to work. Danger zone on. We are gonna do uh, vindication. Faction buff for Ledin. Actually, I'm thinking, should I just move in with Ledin? Yeah, why not? Oh, but the gargoyle can't. The gargoyle can't reach us there. So if I stay there. Yeah, hey, why not? Okay, I'm gonna try something weird. I want to hit all the... Oh, no, that's not good. I want to hit all the... get all the melee enemies, but the Dark Elf General can hit us with Decay if I stand here. So if I stand here, the infantry won't be able to reach us. Ah, uh, decisions, decisions. Okay, let, I will just stand here so that... Uh, we can kill off the Gargoyle if we position uh, correctly which means that we have to uh, stand Ultimula here let me just check his out of range yeah it is okay. stand Ultimula here and let's miracle up I guess okay we are miracled up everybody should move closer Ledin will hit the gargoyle with his faction buff and with Divine Guard on. Wow, it doesn't kill! My goodness. I'm still not going to attack the gargoyle though, because he's going to die to my guard next turn. So there's no point wasting an attack on it, since it will reduce my damage by... Uh, it will reduce my damage by 20% permanently. So I'm going to hit... The Dark Elf General. Ah, I forgot to change Leon's gear back to his usual. Okay, so stay put here. Uh, we're gonna stay put here. Led is gonna stay put here. Liana is gonna come over and heal herself. And we are going... Oh crud, I don't have attack blessing. 
Ah, uh, I forgot to change her skills as well. Well, this is a, a bad run. Hopefully, you can still clear it with all these silly mistakes. So the catapult's coming closer. I better kill the catapult soon. Angel dies. Fantastic, as we hoped. Okay, that is gonna smack the infantry general. Uh, unfortunately, it's not gonna be enough to kill it. The fixed damage is rather nice, however. Hmm. I killed one enemy. So... I'm hoping this will be enough. Great. Because Leon is still as Imba as ever. Um, we're gonna hit the flame skeleton. I'm not sure if this will be enough. Excellent it is. Okay, so since we are on a roll, Holy General is unfortunately still living. Uh, I'm gonna heal up Ledin, get his troops at maximum power. And let's see if we can kill off this infantry general before our divine guard uh, disappears. Okay, great. So it works. Heal up Ledin. Heal. Yep, expected. Okay, so Leon is gonna do the chivalry assault combo. And... Ah, I have a friend next to me. Okay, still enough to kill. So that's SS4. Uh, annoying time law, but... Still doable. Um, unfortunately, we won't get Triple S this week. But looking forward to that next week and the runestone to come.